Hi guys, it's John from Refsix here and I'm here to talk to you about the Trends tab. The Trends tab is a pro feature for pro users in Refsix. What it is, is it's broken down into six sections and we're just going to go through them one by one. So the first one is total matches. This is all the matches you've done through your career while using Refsix. You can change this by pressing the filter in the top right hand corner and then clicking season, year, career, month, or even a custom date. So for the moment, we're just gonna hit season. This gives me the total games I've done for the season. As you can see, I've done 41 games. Now, if you're going for promotion, you have to hit certain criteria. For example, if you're going from level six to level five, you need to do 20 middles, so 20 games as a referee, and 10 lines. And as you can see, in Ref6 Pro, it breaks it down by the number of games you've done at each level making it nice and easy to send off your report to whoever your assessor coordinator is to say this is the games I've done and this is the breakdown of them. How simple can that be? It also gives you a breakdown of goals, how many goals you have a game, goals by home team, goals by away team and the results. So for example I have 9 home team wins, 15 draws and 17 away wins. The next tab is the misconduct tab. This tells us how many yellow cards and how many red cards we've given throughout the year. Now, it gives you a breakdown of the game with the most cards in it. So you can just click on that game and it takes you to that game. As well as it gives you the same information for the red cards, as well as where on the pitch you gave them. Now, the really interesting stuff, and to help you guys improve as a referee, is the yellow card codes. So as you can see, I've given 40 yellow cards for foul tackles and nine for adopting aggressive attitude. The question for me is, am I given too many cards for adopting aggressive attitude? Can I look at the data and say, oh, there are too many cards for dissent. Maybe it's time to you know, use the stepped approach better, really analyze this data and help you improve as a referee. It's also the same when it comes with red cards. Am I given too many for foul and abusive language? Or am I given too many for a dogzo and not serious foul play? You can like go over these little things in your head that allow you to improve as a referee and give you that extra 1% that not a lot of referees can find. The other thing on the trends tabs, it gives you your performance data. So things like how far you've run this whole season or year or career, as well as your heart rate data and how many sprints you've done as well, which is always nice to look at, as well as the finance tab. All these things help you guys become a better referee and the Trends tab allows you to analyse your game as a referee, assistant referee, a fourth official or an observer. We break it down piece by piece so you can improve every aspect of your game. So that's been the Trends tab. Go have a look, look at it yourself and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you at the next Ref6 video.